Can you add Elementor to an existing website? Yes, you can. Now, I'm assuming that your website is running WordPress. If it's not, then you're going to have a problem because Elementor is a WordPress plugin. But assuming you're running WordPress, then you can add Elementor to an existing site. Something that some people wonder is, can Elementor be added to a site that already has other plugins? And yes, of course, Elementor is built to work with lots and lots of different plugins, lots of different themes, and it is used by so many people that there are custom solutions out there for just about everything, and it's generally pretty compatible with most plugins, themes, and other things. And another confusing thing is, can Elementor be used with another page builder? And this one is technically true. I have made the egregious error <laughs> of myself of having multiple page builder plugins installed at once and even running on the same site. I would not recommend it. For example, I've used uh, Thrive Themes and Optimize Press and Elementor in the same site. And that is not a good idea because it's probably going to contribute to some code conflicts, some plugin conflicts, theme conflicts. It's just generally not a great idea in WordPress to have multiple things that are affecting so much of your website. So I would stick to just one page builder and pick one. And if you use Elementor, just use Elementor for building your pages and everything like that. But you can use it with any theme. You can use it with thousands and thousands of plugins. I would say effectively, you can use it with all plugins. Of course, there can be compatibility issues from time to time, but generally Elementor is so broadly used that people basically have to make their plugins work with Elementor because they can assume that there's a good chance that you're using Elementor. Yes, you can add Elementor to an existing website. It's very easy. I will link a couple of videos showing you how to add it if you aren't familiar with the process of adding Elementor to your website. And if you want to learn some more tips and tricks about how to use Elementor, check out the playlist linked at the end of this video and in the description below. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you have any questions or comments, please drop them in the comment section below. And if you found it useful, please hit the like button and maybe subscribe. Finally, take a look at these videos that I linked here and check out the links in the description box below. I've put together some things that I think are particularly useful for what we covered in this video and for you in general. Some of them are affiliate links, so if you end up purchasing any products through them, I may receive a commission. Thank you so much for that support. It helps me to make more videos for you in the future. I hope you enjoy your Elementor journey.